Hi, I'm Troy Johnson. And I'm Jason Dunning with Wilbur Ellis Company here in Grant, Michigan. Uh, today we're standing in our 2010 showcase plot. Uh, Troy, what are we going to see here today? Uh, Jason, uh, we're going to see uh, five stops with our customers today. The first stop is going to be a combination of uh, looking at uh, nematodes and uh, corn along with uh, drift control. The second stop they're going to go to is uh, we're going to look at some small corn. We planted corn three weeks ago. We're going to dig up some plants and, and look for some errors there. Then we're going to move over and we're going to do some tillage with uh, our local Case International dealership, Sparta Farm and Lawn. From there, we're going to go to a live planter demonstration. We're going to plant some corn today and we're going to see if we can pick up some errors and look at what those precision planting products are doing for us on the farm. And then we're going to move over to a root pit. We're going to dig a little deeper today too. Excellent, Troy. Let's get started. Here we are at the first stop looking at uh, drift control, a little bit of in-place demonstration. And we're also talking about corn nematodes. With our second stop here, we were looking at small corn that was planted approximately three weeks ago. In this plot, we will be taking the customers out and digging plants up, looking at planting depth, stand counts, and possible planting errors. Here we are at stop number three. This stop is being conducted by uh, Sparta Farm and Lawn. Here at this stop, they're uh, doing vertical tillage. Today. Here we are at stop number four. This is a live demonstration of Precision Planning's technology. Here we're looking at singulation and spacing from the 2020 monitor, along with variable rate with the row flow and down pressure management with Air Force. Our last stop here today is the root pit. In the root pit we'll be looking at the soil science, looking at sand, silt, and clay layers. We'll also be looking at the root system and the nodal root system, and also looking at compaction demonstrated by the root structure on the current plants we have here today. So this is Todd Hansen at the Grant Showcase Plot. Uh, Todd, what is one thing that you learned today? Um, I, I gave a presentation on uh, seed treatment and uh, and really the, the factors that go into why we're treating seed and, and some of the new things coming like nematicides and I spent quite a bit of time on nematicides and, and uh, one thing that really surprised me is, is how many questions and, and, uh, and different uh, concerns there were about nematodes in corn uh, in the state of Michigan. And, and a lot of the growers had a lot of good questions and a lot of concerns that, that uh, you know, some of the areas of their fields where they've had problems are, are probably due to nematodes uh, rather than just poor soil or things like that. And I, I think they're that uh, I learned that there's there's probably more opportunity for, for nematicides as seed treatment uh, on corn here than, uh, than maybe we originally thought there was. And how does this plot stack up against other plots you may have been to this year? This is, uh, well, this is really a high quality plot. I mean, it's, it's laid out very well. There's a lot of space in between um, where we're going and, and uh, with all of the, uh, the demonstrations that were here today, it was uh, really an unbelievable learning experience for these growers uh, from uh, precision planting uh, to the root pit um, and uh, just great demonstrations all the way around. I'm with Doug Van Houten today at the Grant Showcase plot. Doug, what's one thing that you've learned today from this plot? I learned a lot about drift management and how important it is to manage your spray and get it put in place where you want it. How it can save you money and you know gives you a better job of controlling your weed pressure. How does this plot compare to other plots that you may have been to in the past year? Honestly, this is the best plot tour I've ever been to. You guys have done an awesome job, and there's been so much uh, information here that it's a lot to process. So. It's 
very, very impressive. Thank you, Doug. We're here today with Rebel Smith from the Fremont FFA at the Grant Showcase Plot. Rebel, what is one of the things that you learned today? I think uh, one of the real big things that I'm going to take away from this experience are all of the different opportunities that are out there for um, my students to get involved in the agricultural industry. Um, seeing all the technology that's available, the different science that goes into all the different seeds, chemicals, um, fertilizers, all that different stuff, all the different opportunities that are out there for students will be really uh, beneficial to me and the students that were here. How would this showcase plot stack up against other ones that you possibly have gone to this year? Well, this is the, the first showcase plot that I've been to, um, but I just think that it's a, a phenomenal learning environment out here. Um, it's too bad that more students couldn't come out or that we couldn't take something like this into the classroom because the hands-on learning out here, the opportunity to actually see what it is, um, to see a first-hand application of um, different practices that are out there is just uh, second to none. So it's been a really good experience and I just wish that more of my students could see it firsthand. I'm Jason Dunning. And I'm Troy Johnson. And on behalf of Wilbur Ellis Company here at Grant, Michigan, we'd like to thank you for coming out today and we look forward to seeing you in 2011.